So this video campaign is for a Sami 2 sleep monitor and the successful bidder behind this piece of equipment is Yvonne Burton. So Yvonne, would you like to just introduce yourself? What's your title? And Certainly. Your... Yeah, so my name's Yvonne Burton. I am the epilepsy nurse specialist here at Basingstoke Hospital. And I've been in this position now for three years. And we are always looking at ways to be able to help our patients at home and to be able to acknowledge what seizures are happening at home. And hopefully this piece of kit will allow us to do that. Does that mean that currently you don't have that facility to, mon to monitor people at home? So wh what's the sort of typical experience if somebody with epilepsy, they have an incident at home? maybe yeah. then their family knows how to put them in the recovery position or yeah. what's kind of typical not even that so sometimes we will see patients who've had seizures for the very first time mm -hmm. they will be very scared be very anxious the family won't have a clue what to do and so then obviously they go through the process of seeing a neurologist they'll get referred to us the epilepsy nurses who then give them that added detail and that added information about how to make their life a little bit easier and protect them and from a safety side of things as well. So the so what's the actual so the equipment I've seen pictures of it. Just look, you talk us through what yeah, exactly yeah. is involved. Yeah, so the equipment is very simple. Really, it involves our infrared camera, which will work in night vision mode. Mm -hmm. It involves an iPad as well, and that camera will link to the iPad. And what happens is the camera will pick up any unusual movements. So it won't pick up regular tossing and turning. But if there's unusual seizure movements, then that will pick that up and it will record it for that duration and then it will time log it all on the iPad also. And at what point does the, do you guys then pick that up? Do you kind of look at it in arrears or so, real so, time? or No, how? so we won't look at it in real time. It all gets downloaded onto the iPad, which the patient will have on their person. Mm. And then when they bring it back, so we're proposing that they have it for five nights. Um, or a week and then they'll bring it back to us in the office and then we'll be able to go through all the time log status then and it's really helpful because it means that for especially for patients who are living on their own that don't have that added person sleeping next to them or even in the same house it is able to tell us if this patient's having seizure activity at night time okay and so uh, i guess then if it's if if they're if they're okay then they won't be having any difficult nights no which exactly. then means they don't have to come into hospital. Quite, etc. yeah. And uh, I also read that you, if, if everybody has it for a week, that means you do 52 yeah. people a year. Yeah. You're looking to get one for Basingstoke and one for Winchester. Yes, please, yeah, because we do cover both sites and we don't want people having to travel to, Win to Basingstoke if they don't have to. Okay, what happens to people in Andover, for instance? Because obviously that's part of our trust. Absolutely. So for people in Andover, we do, the epilepsy nurse at Winchester does visit Andover on a weekly basis mm -hmm. also. So it could be a case that they could just drop it into her on her clinic day and then she redistributes it after then. Okay, so, but I suppose Andover patients could obviously have this absolutely. piece of kit yeah, in their home yeah, as well. Absolutely. If we were to able to raise enough money for three pieces of kit, yeah. definitely. Okay. Um, so really useful piece of equipment for the epilepsy team and uh, if, you, if you're on this video there's a donate button right next to it so if you click that all the money that's raised will go directly to purchasing the Sami kit um, for Yvonne and her team so uh, click now and give us some money. Thank you so much. Thank you.